all right guys so yeah this is a new video not one i was expecting to make and it's very exciting so we got the official word that john diggle is returning david ramsey's gonna direct like five episodes himself across the whole Arrowverse, including supergirl and superman lois also he is going to be returning as john diggle in all of the shows in all of the shows this is like our first piece of crossover news I'm really, really excited. He's also going to be returning as a mystery character on Legends of Tomorrow. We've got a lot to talk about, so let's go ahead and get into this. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. So yes, what exciting news. We just got the official announcement coming from Deadline that David Ramsey is going to return to direct He's going to return as John Diggle, and he's going to return as a mystery character in the CW's Arrowverse. This is the biggest thing to come out since the announcement of Crisis, or since Crisis on Infinite Earths happened, because we were all expecting David to come back at some point and return as John Diggle, maybe direct an episode or two, but we never expected such a big announcement like this to ever come out. So let's go ahead and go through this article and freak out break this down this is the most exciting piece of news we've had in a long long time so this exclusive comes from deadline it'll be in the link in the description below so it says david ramsey aka john diggle will be busy both behind and in front of the camera for the cw ramsey who most recently starred in arrow as john diggle slash spartan will return to direct five episodes in the dc universe including the new superhero series superman and lois and Supergirl. Additionally, Ramsey will guest star in five new episodes across the Arrowverse, returning as fan favorite John Diggle and Superman Lois, Supergirl, The Flash, and Batwoman, along with a mystery role in DC's Legends of Tomorrow, which is kept under wraps. Ramsey made his directorial debut in 2018 with Arrow and directed a second episode during the series' final season. In the series finale of Arrow, Ramsey's John Diggle moved to Metropolis after finding an emerald ring, presumably the power ring worn by Green Lantern, in the pages of DC Comics. There has been much speculation that Diggle will return at some point as Green Lantern, so stay tuned. This is the comment from him. I remain in awe of the imprint these shows have had on television, and I've been blessed for the better part of a decade to be a part of them, both in front and behind the camera, said Ramsey. To say I'm excited beyond belief to return to the Belantiverse would be an understatement. I can't wait to continue telling these stories. So yes, that is the huge announcement that David Ramsey is returning all over the Arrowverse, not just on one specific show, but on literally every single show. So let's go through this bit by bit. David Ramsey is coming back to direct five episodes in the Arrowverse across all of the shows. The shows that are named in terms of him directing is an episode or two from Superman and Lois. So that is the new show that is coming out this year. So presumably he's going to be directing these episodes maybe in the back half of the season or around the mid season where, you know, you would normally get to the midpoint of the show. So that's very interesting. But more interesting to me is he's going to be directing a Supergo episode. I'm very, very excited about this because I love David Ramsey and I love John Diggle and just the fact that, you know, one of the old cast members whose show has gone away is going to return to like one of the best shows in the ZW in my opinion, Supergirl. That's really exciting, but also it's really, really exciting for Superman Lois because you've got such an established person in the Arrowverse coming to steer the way in like one or two episodes at least. And possibly for the future, it definitely hints at he's going to be returning like non-stop. So this is so exciting. However, I think the most exciting thing to all fans, obviously him returning to direct is fantastic across of, you know, all the shows, you know, the specific ones named are Supergirl and Superman and Lois. And so he's got five episodes there. But I think the most exciting thing for everyone is that he is returning as John Diggle across five episodes in the Arrowverse. Five episodes! That is so many! Five episodes! It's not even gonna be, you know, specifically a crossover or something, but the fact that he's showing up on all of these shows, and we'll go over the specific shows in a minute, that are named, which they literally name every CW show that is going on 
and is gonna come out. He has literally signed this contract to be like, yes, this is an Arrowverse contract. You can show up in any show you want and you can direct on any show you want. It seems like the CW really doesn't wanna let go of David Ramsey and his talent. And I think this is the best news for all Arrowverse fans because he was such a fan favorite and I always loved John Diggle and he did actually appear post Arrow on a Flash episode just after Crisis and just after Arrow's ending. And so I was kind of just waiting for him to come back, maybe as Green Lantern or something like that. But now he's coming back in five episodes, that is insane. I can't wait, I love it so much. And so what shows is he gonna return as John Diggle on? He's returning on Superman Lois, obviously for the first time. He's going to be on Supergirl. He's on The Flash once again, obviously that is the most important one because he's been there many times, he's crossed over by himself, even without Green Arrow and Oliver and everyone. Like, you know, that's just a kind of no-brainer. And then also Batwoman, but then also Legends of Tomorrow as a mystery role. So it's not gonna be John Diggle. Who might that be? Well, we'll get to that in just a moment. Let's talk about Superman Lois. I think due to him being in Metropolis, that is definitely a way for him to cross over into Superman Lois. Obviously, I think he's going to be traveling around. I don't know what Diggle specifically is going to do. I don't know if he is a fully fledged Green Lantern or not by the time he returns. But it seems like this is our first official crossover, you know, post all of this craziness in the world. And so he's going to be showing up probably in the back half, maybe around the midpoint of the seasons on all of these shows. I'm presuming he's going to return in the two episode crossover that they're planning on Batwoman and Superman and Lois. I would say that's probably the best time for him to return because, you know, you have these two sh crossing over because you have these two shows crossing over and it'll be like a back to back thing. And then you've also got him showing up on Supergirl, which is really exciting because it is Supergirl's final season. And it's very reassuring that we're going to see people crossing over in Supergirl's final season and maybe this kind of confirms a little bit about you know maybe Grant showing up on Supergirl because you know you got another guest star on the show from another show so that is a really good sign for Barry potentially returning to Supergirl and so that's really exciting I always wanted an Arrow and Supergirl crossover and this is the one we're gonna get and I'm all in for this even without Oliver maybe Stephen will come back at some point this season Considering that he would be like pretty jealous I think that David Ramsey's coming back for such a long time and putting such effort into the Arrowverse even post Arrow And yeah, he's also showing up in the flash like I said this makes the most sense because he's crossed over by himself onto the flash before They're great friends. I think they're the best of friends out of all the remaining shows Diggle fits in the best with the flash, but then we have to talk about Legends of Tomorrow What is going on here? Who is this mystery role? that he's going to be showing up as in Legends. Well, this is being kept under wraps as of right now, but I think it's pretty damn obvious that he's going to be showing up as Green Lantern. I don't know if it's gonna be our normal version of Diggle or if it's going to be an alternate version of Diggle, but because it's not Diggle himself, it is a mystery. I feel like it's got to be Green Lantern or like a different version of himself because that's literally what they set up at the end of Arrow and I think it would be perfect for him to show up on Legends specifically because he can be anywhere in time and Legends can, you know, make him come onto the show. So that's fascinating and I think this may lead into the crossover because I really do feel like at one point we're gonna see him actually show up in a crossover like this specific season because this news does scream crossover to me. I don't know about you guys, but considering he's returning all over the Arrowverse, surely he's going to show up for those two Arrowverse crossover episodes this season. So that's why I'm saying Superman, Lois, and Batwoman, I think the episodes he'll show up in is that specific crossover. Because I think that makes the most sense. And then I think he'll show up on other episodes of Supergirl, The Flash, Legends. And then obviously he's going to direct Superman, Lois, Supergirl, and possibly some of the other shows. So this is so, so exciting, guys. I've never been more excited about the Arrowverse, about the future of these upcoming seasons. It's been a long time since, you know, there's been something as exciting as this announced. And, you know, they were definitely sitting on this news and they were finally ready to do this as we start hyping up to, you know, 
the next seasons that are coming pretty soon. As we just got our first trailer for Batwoman, we had the episode titles revealed of The Flash and Superman and Lois. So they are amping up stuff and it's so exciting to see this piece of massive news. So please be sure to rain down hell in the comments how excited you are about this news, this breaking news that really is going to break the whole internet. So for now, please be sure to leave a like, leave that comment. Also subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss any Arrowverse videos as we head towards our new seasons. Very, very excited. I've also just moved places. So now I'm, you know, kind of settling in and there will be a new setup for the live stream this Thursday. So be on the lookout for that. It's going to be very exciting to be in this new place and talking with you guys on our weekly live streams. The DC TV show is going to continue this Thursday, 8 to 9 p.m. UK time, sometime around then. So, yeah, stay tuned for that. Sound off in the comments about this. And for now, I'll catch you guys later. Goodbye. I see red.